Hey, what is up, YouTube? Um, today I know it's the day that you've all been waiting for, and yes, it is how to download and burn Xbox 360 games, updated version. Um, this one is gonna have better quality, better sound quality, so you guys can hear me. Um, better links, and um, yeah, uh, and don't forget to subscribe because I'm only doing this because of you subscribers. And if I don't get any more, then I'm probably not gonna do another updated. Uh, or more like Xbox 360 cheats, hacks, PS3 hacks. Um, so yeah, and another thing, you need to have your Xbox 360 modded. People, quit PMing me, quit commenting. Do you have to have your Xbox 360 modded? Of course you need it modded. X or um, Microsoft isn't just gonna give it out of the box so it can burn PS or so it can play burnt games. What would be the point of that? So yes, you need that flash. And if you guys want, uh, if you guys want a video of me uh, or teaching you guys how to flash it, then I will more than likely or more than be happy to do that. But if you guys don't want it, then I won't do it. It's what's the point? And um, what this video entails is I'm going to show you um, the like the actual applications that you're going to need to um, burn the games or like uh, what you're going to need to download and burn the games. And I'm going to show you how to do it. Alright, so first, uh, go in your internet browser. And um, go to downloads.com. Now, don't worry if I'm going too fast, but I will have all the links in the description of what you need. Now, what you're going to need is WinRAR. Um, this will actually... Um, let you be able to view the RAR files that you're downloading, which is what you will be downloading to get the actual game. So you just need this and get download now. The second thing you're going to need is go to downloads.com again, or just go up into the search bar and type in power ISO. Um, then just get download now. And then once those are done, um, go to your desktop, install them, so uh, you will have this, and then whenever you download a RAR file, it will look like a stack of books. Um, I'll show you I'll show you what I mean in a little bit. Uh, now let's go to new tab. Now you're going to go to xbox360iso.com, as you can see up here um, in the thing. Now let me see if my thing still works. Huh, still works. Well, that's good. Um, but yeah, just go down until. You, oh my God! Just keep going down until you see Xbox 360 downloads right here, and then go down to Xbox 360 DVD game downloads. Now, um, the, what I rep or what I recommend are webs or um, threads that have this the MU which is mega upload which is the fastest downloading website I've I've used all the time now uh, as you can see there are tons and tons of threads of games that you can download but uh, let's just go to right here mega upload game lists yada yada yada, yada. now um, as you can see they have 50 cent bloods on the sand on the sand region free these are all region free well, this one's NTSC, but if you live in North America, you're going to need NTSC. If you live in Europe, you're going to need PAL, so on and so forth. You you get the pa you get the idea. And um yeah, all you have to do is just uh open one of these links. Uh and then once you get to the download page, um Type in the code, click download file, and then it should say regular download. Just click that. And once you're done downloading all of these links right here, all of these links, you go to the very first one you downloaded, open it up, extract it to your desktop, and once you're done extracting files from the RAR, the RAR folder, um, open up Power so go to add right here, click add, and then go to your desktop grab whatever file that you downloaded or that you extracted say this is the one you extracted click add and then this bar is going to fill up about um 7.9 to 8.5 gigs 
uh, depending on how big the game was. And then right when this bar fills up and all the files are in here, you're going to click burn. Now, what the CDs that you use are, they are dual layer, 8.7 gigs of space. You need dual layer. I recommend verbatim because they are the cheapest and work the best. So, um, just go out to your local Walgreens and pick one up. And, um, yeah, this is all you need to do to download and burn Xbox 360 games. And do not forget your 360 needs to be modded. Um, which is common sense to everybody. But, um, yeah. Now, don't forget to subscribe because that's the only reason why I'm doing this, yada, yada, yada. And, um, thanks for watching. And if you guys have any questions, just leave me a comment or go to my PM box and message me. And I will be more than likely to help you out. Alright, um, thanks for watching, guys. And if I did miss anything, um, don't forget to let me know because I want to make this the best tutorial that I've made ever. Alright, thanks for watching.